Hello, this is the Jurassic Expert. You're back with another Jurassic News video. And today, uh, a bunch of new exciting news has come out. Um, it seems like it never stops, really. Um, so this week in news, uh, first of all, the, um, Legacy Collection, Ian Malcolm, and Velociraptor 2-pack has started to hit stores, I think in Mexico, actually. Um, and, yeah, uh, so this one, uh, when the images first came out, it, it seems like nothing has changed. If you see it on eBay or anything like that, unless you're like a completionist with even packaging and all that, I really would not suggest you to buy like scalper prices for this. Um, but the fact that it has come to Mexico though, I am curious if it will come to the US or if it's just going to kind of stop at the border there. Um, but that would be really exciting to uh, see them uh, come over to the US if that happens. Don't quote me on that if don't quote me on that. I mean, I have no ties with Mattel at all. There's a chance that uh, it, it might not ever come to the U.S., but I'm hopeful. But the interesting thing is, also in that picture, there was the Jurassic Park 3 female Velociraptor with Alan Grant. And um, the female raptor seems very different from the first uh, release of those figures. And I know because I actually have the female raptor. Um, and I noticed that there's like extra patterning on it, on like its head and on its neck and stuff like that. So yeah, that's interesting. If it does come to the US, I will actually consider getting that. Uh, if not, if I find it for a good price, maybe I'll get it. But yeah, so that's exciting. And the next news also happens to be coming from Mexico as well, which is the fact that the Legacy Collection Brachiosaurus has been popping up in Mexico. And a lot of the like Hispanic uh, YouTubers and all that, they have been, um, I've been seeing a lot of the Brachiosaurus reviews. Now, it has been estimated that the Brachiosaurus will be released sometime in October. So, for the US at least. But, who knows, maybe it will come earlier now that it is popping up in Mexico. It might start popping up in the US a lot sooner than expected. But, it usually takes around a month or two when stuff initially starts releasing in Mexico for it to pop up in the U.S. If it comes to the U.S. But Mattel has made it clear that, yeah, they are making it one of their number one priority. They are making it a very high priority to get the Brachiosaurus out to everyone. And not just limited to a certain group of people. Um... So, the next big news is that Mattel has announced two of their 2021 dinosaur figures for their Primal Attack line, and the two new figures, and I guess them correctly, are the Sarcosuchus and the Tarbosaurus, two of which I guessed in my guessing the 2021 Jurassic World figures silhouette video, I mean... Go check out that video if you have not already. Uh, and yeah, so I guessed them correctly. And a couple of the names for the kind of different levels of figures. Kind of like now how we have the attack packs, the Savage Strike, the uh, Dual Attack, Mega Dual Attack, etc. We're going to be having similar things to that next year for 2021. And... I don't remember the names, so future Jurassic Expert, just put them up on the screen for them. There you go. Um, so yeah, a lot of interesting news has come out. Um, but yeah, this is kind of a short Jurassic News video. Oh, I wanted to mention that uh, for those of you that are interested in the 
miniature Jurassic World figures in the blind packs and all that, you might know about the the metallic Indominus Rex that has been found for, to be the new exclusive. Well, they are starting to pop up. I know, especially in Targets, because I recently went to a Target and I found one. So yeah, I actually got one. The, the I got one of the uh, the metallic Indominus Rexes. Uh, that is pretty much all the news that I have for now. Um, so to get more news videos like this one, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified whenever I put new new Jurassic news videos like this one. And as always, dinosaurs might be older than you, but you are never too old for dinosaurs. Bye bye. <laughs>